This is Gary Hudson at Folkstone Guitars, and today I want to talk to you about a problem with Martin binding. This is only true that, as far as I know, of Martin guitars, and I've worked on a lot of guitars in this shop, and I tell you, I get this issue with Martin guitars quite frequently, and that is with the binding shrinking around the body and becoming detached. Now this is something that doesn't happen on on tailors that come in. It doesn't happen with with uh, Guild guitars, Larravee guitars, Yamahas. In fact it doesn't even happen with $99 acoustic guitars. It only happens with Martins. On this Martin guitar the binding is shrinking and becoming detached on all the inside corners front and back now this is a 2012 OM21 Martin guitar a great guitar a great sounding guitar acoustically okay I'm not criticizing Martin guitars I'm saying that the binding on these guitars shrinks and becomes detached on at least in my estimation in my opinion I would say it happens on about one in every ten Martin guitars so if you're gonna get an acoustic guitar and you want to get a Martin I do not recommend that you get one with body binding the mahogany models don't have any binding there's some others that don't have any binding on the body those are fine but, uh, man, when it comes to this issue here, and the only thing that will repair this, the only thing that I know of that, that holds it on there, I mean, you can't just take any kind of glue and glue this back on. The only thing I know of that works is this bind-all from Stuart McDonald. But the problem with using the bind-all is, is when you get it in the track and you go to to glue this back into the track, it oozes out. This glue here, this stuff, it oozes out and it gets on the finish. This is a very fine lacquer finish. And sometimes, not every time, but sometimes when the glue dries and you go to peel it off of that finish, the finish comes off with it. So then you have all this lacquer finish checking around the binding where you've made the repair and then you wind up having to air gun lacquer this area, repair the whole thing, and then buffer wheel it. No, no, that's, first of all, I don't have a 14-inch buffer wheel to do this. And I'm not going to touch this finish. I'm not going to mess this finish up, okay? Now, this is the third Martin with body binding issues like this, the detachment. This is the third one I've seen in a single week. And that's why I'm making this video because this happens so frequently that now I'm just giving these issues over to Martin. And I'm saying, Martin, this is your problem. Please fix it. Uh, we're tired of doing it here. Uh, I'm not going to do any more uh, Martin uh, binding work. Now, if you need a, a new bridge or a bridge reset or a JLD bridge system or stainless steel frets, or anything else, or even a, re a neck reset on your Martin. I'll do that, but I'm not doing this binding repair any longer. And when it's repaired, by the way, <clears throat> if you don't replace the binding, if you just want to glue this binding back on, the other thing you have to do is you have to cut it because you got to relieve that tension or it won't lay down. It'll just come unglued again. So you have to cut it, relieve the tension, and that leaves a little gap there. And the binding and what I have <clears throat> done is I've either left the gap or I have made a mixture of uh, binding material that's the color I'm, I'm working with with acetone and I've I've made a, a bond out of it and and I've actually filled those those gaps at times but it, you know, it's a mess to deal with, okay? And the thing that, that's so risky about it, the number one issue I have is with the binding glue uh, eating these Martin finishes, which are very fine nitro lacquer, lacquer uh, finishes. 
So, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, anyway, folks, I'm saying that this this is a problem that I have seen with everything from D18s to D41s. I'd say by my estimation, it happens on about one out of every 10 Martins. And this is the third one I've gotten in a week. And that's why I have <laughs> made this video because I am quite literally fed up with this issue with Martin guitars. Martin, are you listening? Martin, fix this issue with your binding shrinking and becoming detached from these very fine, very great guitars. Thank you.